Today's treatment planning can require much more than just listing procedures. Being able to divide treatment into phases and appointments and then each procedure to be performed. Who will be seeing the patient? How much time is needed? What time interval is required before the next phase or appointment? What special materials might be needed? These are all important criteria in planning and carrying out a treatment project. The Smart TX Planner can do all of these things. It also provides an on-screen replacement for the old-fashioned routing slip so that the front office will know exactly how to appoint the patient and how to bill for services. Let's take a closer look at treatment planning, possibly one of the most powerful and sophisticated features of time. Here we see the entry of multiple treatment plans in this particular window. The appointments that are in gray tell us that those procedures have been performed, or the ones that are crossed out, it was elected to not perform those procedures because they were found not to be necessary. So a reevaluation may have been done today, and that led to the development of a new treatment plan, a multi-phased treatment plan, such as you see here. So we can divide our treatment planning into multiple plans. Each plan can have multiple phases. Each phase can have multiple appointments. And each appointment can have multiple procedures listing its location as well. Let's take a closer look at how these things are entered. Here we see the Smart Treatment Planner. I'm going to scroll down a little ways and show you some of the things that it can do. For example, I'm going to do a sinus augmentation in this particular location. If I double click on that, I want to select some special materials to be present on my tray that day. So I'm going to go into materials selection. What type of allographs would I like to include? Well, I might want to have this available and I might want to have that available. Are there any alloplastic materials that I might wish to use? I want to make certain there's an appliance ready for me at that time, too, that it's been received from the restorative practice. I'm going to have a barrier membrane in place just in case I elect to use it. Sinus augmentations, I always like to use certain growth enhancement factors. I'm going to use some of this material or I want it to be available. But then again, I might also want to use this in its place. So I can build a materials list. In addition, of course, I can select sites. I'm going to be doing that sinus augmentation above these sites. If I go back, and I go into that appointment, I can select how much time I want for that appointment. I can select naturally who it's going to be with. I can talk about the fact that I want it to be delayed for a number of days or weeks or months. All of those things can be defined in the Smart Treatment Planner. Categories of procedures to be included in a particular appointment are what you see here. We're down to a new appointment now in this particular phase. And I'm just going to show you how you can go into any of these and you can pick any particular procedure that you wish to be included in that appointment. Merely by double clicking on it, it would be added. And again, you can put a site in. So again, just by selecting from lists with mouse clicks, you build statements in the time chart. That gives you a nice overview of this very powerful feature, the Smart Treatment Planner. Now when my patient appears at the front desk and the receptionist needs information about how to appoint the patient, all he or she needs to do is to click on the particular appointment. For example, for that sinus augmentation appointment, by merely double-clicking on that, time will bring up this routing sheet for her. She'll know who to make the appointment with, how long that appointment needs to be, what procedure codes need to be built into the billing system, 
and my chair-sided surgical assistant will know what materials and items that I want available for that particular procedure as well. Application linking is one of the most powerful features of time. You as an end user can virtually create a connection to launch any other application on your practice's network or any website that you commonly like to utilize. These are all listed under this Applications menu. If I open that menu, I can see that I have links to my digital radiograph database, my digital clinical photo database, to a number of different medical areas. For example, if I put in drugs that this patient is currently taking, I can click on the Lexicomp Drug Interaction Check, and I will be automatically logged into my Lexicom account the medications the patient is taking are listed for me and all of their potential drug interactions. I then can go ahead and put in the names of other medications that I may wish to prescribe to the patient and the application will then display for me their interactions as well. Again, it's very simple for me to add sites or applications to this list by merely going in and putting a name in, a web address, or the path to the executable file for the application on my network. And I then can save that and have as many links to as many different applications or websites as I wish. Time is a fully customizable EMR. Templates for letters, patient instructions, informed consents, prescriptions, can all be customized to your practice. Paths for charting can be customized. Content of procedure forms can be customized. Links to other applications and websites can be created. Times Anesthesia Analgesia Record is simply the most comprehensive and most versatile available in any dental software. It can be used to document general anesthesia, IV conscious sedation, or even orally administered analgesia. Vitals and OSAT can be automatically populated into the record from a Criticare non-invasive blood pressure monitor via serial cable connection between the monitor and your computer. Simply put, time provides you with total information management effectiveness for the clinical portion of your patient records. It streamlines your communication with referrers and patients. It reduces time and costs while producing better records. It provides greater record security and risk management. And it certainly can improve patient perception of your practice and satisfaction with your services. The costs associated with pulling, filing, and hunting for charts and dictation and transcription costs for letter production can all be eliminated. Simply put, you can't afford to continue practicing without time. We invite you to phone DecisionBase to set up a personal private web conference with one of our consultants who will be happy to provide you with a more detailed demonstration of time and to answer your questions about improving communications, reducing overhead expense, and how you can safely and sanely convert from paper to digital information management in your practice.